YouTube. Just thought I'd make a quick video. It's been a long time, but yesterday, I think last week, I've been working on this tank. I haven't gotten the opportunity to actually do anything to it, so it grew a massive amount of algae. And um, I managed to, I mean, despite the fact that I was doing my water changes religiously, still, I noticed my phosphates started to go up a little bit, not major. Uh, usually I keep everything at zero. Um, I'm losing a couple of corals because they're going to war with each other. You can see my meteor showers back there. Um, they're being, I guess, being struck by that collage that I have of hammers mixed with frog spawns and they seem to be doing extremely well. Um, Losing a couple of mushrooms. I don't know what's attacking it or eating it or messing with it. But again, guys, I'm working so much. I don't have that much time. I do give them water changes. And I did scrub the, the glass religiously. So the glass is sparkling. I cleaned up the, the Javao <clears throat> wave maker, which was encrusted completely in coralline um, algae which look cool but I think it would slow the performance down right now I got it off because I'm just feeding these little guys this pump right here this Aquion had a right back there in the uh, slots where it siphons the water in it had like a big giant afro of algae so and now it looks like as if nothing happened, brand new. But they're working much more um, optimal, way better. The performance went up, so I'm gonna need to definitely take some time and tear this tank down and do a different aquascape and pick what corals I want to keep and which ones. I'm, I mean, so far I'm thinking about the frog spawns and hammers. Um, What's left of my Monty, I gotta break it off there. This carpet anemone, this this is all one rock, one cluttered collage. Definitely keeping my Duncans. Um, my Zoas, I never had like a real good uh, experience with them. They've sub Those are like two years old, but they don't spread. Um, <clears throat> I haven't been able to get in there and individually feed them. But then now you see that they're being encrusted by the flower pot coral. Um, it's crazy. So I don't know if they're being, I think they're being suffocated out and dominated by them. So I may have to smash that rock, try to separate from, I mean, those things, I don't know. Uh, this guy, this leather coral is going to stay with me. And, um, you know, it seems like, and there's Gorgonia. So... And that cold coral back there, I'm going to see if I can revive it because it's starting to look really... see it back there waving, laying down. It's hanging on. But hanging in there. But I'm going to have to end this palithoa. It's all going to go to one of my buddies or something. But anywho, guys, I just thought I'd do a short video. Um, it's been a long time. Hope you enjoy. Thumbs up. Subscribe, comment. Peace.